Iron Gate resident Scotty Enro agreed to speak with Journal TV about a unique property sale that occurred tonight. It's Thursday, September 27th, 2018. Scotty, thanks very much for joining us. Not a problem. This particular piece of property was auctioned at 7 p.m. this evening. Scotty was the only bidder, but this is a process that resulted over a period of approximately a couple of months. Scotty, a lot of people in the Highlands would like to know, this property is not buildable. It's at the end of a street next to the railroad. Can you tell everybody why did you want this particular piece of property? Well, yes, sir. I'm a, a lifelong resident of Iron Gate. I was away for four or five years when I went to college, but I've had the opportunity to move back and live in this area. Uh, one of my fondest memories was a local older gentleman when I was a child that used to grow pumpkins before uh, the children of Iron Gate for Halloween. Uh, I'd like to use a good, good little portion of this property. It's not a very big piece, but it's big enough for a decent pumpkin patch and be able to uh, do the exact same thing. It's just a childhood memory that I've, that I've always liked and I'd like to share it with some, uh, some of the children of the town. Well, I, I think, Scotty, I think the public should realize that under normal circumstances, a piece of ground like this probably would have gone for $300 or $400. But as a result of a bunch of advertising and the survey and all this, what did you agree this evening? I think I just saw you write the check. What did you agree to pay for this parcel? $1,550 for the piece of property. Uh, and again, um, that's probably a pretty high price, but for me, uh, I enjoy stuff like this, so it's worth it. And so once a year, there's going to be a beautiful pumpkin patch for the kids of Iron Gate in the Allegheny Highlands? I hope it's beautiful. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> so, but uh, yeah, we, uh, that's, that's the plan anyway. So um, if we have the right weather and the right conditions, we'll have pumpkins next fall. Yeah, oh, next fall. And, and then other than that, is will this be a garden? It's not really Pro buildable. No, no it's, it's, be? It, the, it's probably going to be a, a garden with you know, typical corn squash. I have a small garden already. I'll just expand on that a little bit and towards the down the end of the property will be a nice pumpkin patch and who knows maybe the great pumpkin will show up you never you never can tell uh, that's one of my favorite uh, peanuts cartoons so. well you've answered a big question that's been the of the interest of the people in the highlands and we thank you very much for joining us Steve. not a problem thank you